good day everyone today let us have another problem involving second law of thermodynamics under thermodynamics and heat transfer for a part one problem we have a gasoline engine that takes in 12,000 joules of heat energy per cycle and produces 2,400 joules of mechanical work we are tasked to find these following problems, these following questions. How much heat energy is removed per cycle? What is the efficiency? What mass of fuel is consumed in each cycle if the heat of combustion is 45,000 joules per gram? And if the engine goes through 50 cycles per second, what is the power rating in watts? Kilowatts and the horsepower. So listed on our left, extreme left, are some of our given. We have here solution for our first question. How much heat energy is removed per cycle? So this is going, we're going to use this formula. QC for our heat removed is equivalent to the heat added minus the work. So we know in our problem that there is a heat addition that is equivalent to 12,000 joules and there is a work output a mechanical work after being applied after applied some heat on the system to be 12,000 joules the equivalent work output in mechanical work is 2,400 joules so the difference of both is 9600 joules so that is the heat energy that was removed in the cycle let's proceed to our next question what is the efficiency the efficient what is the efficiency of the gasoline engine after doing some work and after applied some heat addition so we multiply that for to 100 percent and let's find out we have a work of 2400 joules um, divided by the heat added in the gasoline engine to be 12,000 joules multiplied to 100 percent we have now the efficiency of the gasoline engine to be 20 percent moving on to our Third question, what mass of fuel is consumed in each cycle if the heat of combustion is 45,000 joules per gram? So, in this part, we have a condition. What should be the mass of fuel is consumed in each cycle if the heat of combustion is 45,000 joules per gram? So, I have here our mass is equivalent to the um, the heat addition 12,000 joules and all over 1 gram because in each cycle and how much fuel is consumed if each cycle the heat combustion is 45,000 joules per gram so after doing some calculations we have the mass of the fuel to be 0 0.2667 grams next um, if the engine goes through 50 cycles per second, what is its equivalent? Watts, kilowatts, and in horsepower. So we have here on our extreme left, we have the conversion, conversion units. For our time, we have 0. Point, for our time per cycle, we have 0 0.02 seconds per cycle. And we know that joules per second is watts. So plugging in the given, the needed values, 1,400, that is the heat addition. And divide by our work done in a cycle of 0 0.20 seconds. We have now a power that is 120,000 watts. So next, how about what is the power in kilowatts? So let's do some conversion units. We have 120,000 watts 
multiplied to 1 kilowatts is equivalent to 1000 watts then the power in kilowatts would be 120,000 kilowatts and last for our power in horsepower we have the watts to be 120,000 watts multiplied to its conversion units there is 746 watts and 1 horsepower so solving we now have the power in horsepower to be 160.9 horsepower so that's it for this problem and thank you so much for listening thank you so much for learning with me and see you on our upcoming videos to come